Welcome to Connects Corner. Today, I'm going to talk to you about Terry Pratchett's Witches Abroad. This is now my second favorite Discworld novel. Um, so my ranking is Mort, this, Witches Abroad, and then uh, uh, Guards Guards. All three were fantastic. This one here is the best of the Witch series so far. Absolutely love Nanny Og and Granny Weatherwax. The two of them are hilarious in here. They go about their adventure in the world with a fairy godmother. And there's some callbacks to Cinderella and things like that. This book was phenomenal. Had me laughing. Had me smiling. There were moments when I was on the bus that I kind of started chuckling to myself because of what was happening. I... Uh, Really enjoy uh, Terry Pratchett. I don't know how many books I'm into so far uh, with his stuff. Must be uh, I must have done twelve now because we did two every second month. So yeah, I've done twelve of his books now, and he is a fantastic writer. If you're looking for something that's light and fluffy, that is just a bunch of fun. Terry Pratchett is the way to go, and most of his books are very small, very short, um, very easy to get through, and uh, they are very minimal time investment uh, when it comes to reading them. That is why I enjoy them so much and have been enjoying reading them throughout this year. Uh, my read-along sort of got sidetracked because not as many people were joining in, not everyone was interested in all the storylines. Some people wanted to do just some of the stories and not others. And that's perfectly fine. I My goal was just to get people introduced into this and to start reading it myself. And that's been successful. I have had a lot of people introduced into it along with me. And now they are going on their own paths of reading for it. And I am going to continue reading Discworld into next year as well. I will probably do one book every two months as opposed to two books every two months, but I intend fully on continuing on because Terry Pratchett is fantastic. He is hilarious. This is basically Monty Python's on paper, uh, in my opinion. So if you are interested in checking out some Terry Pratchett, this one is a fantastic one. It can work as a standalone. You don't need to read the other witch books to get it. If you do, you'll get other things that are within it, but you can do without if you want, and it's a really fun read. I hope that you're all doing well. Thank you so much for coming to the corner, and I hope that you are uh, enjoying what you are reading these days. Take care, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.